Well, thank you, Captain. Hello and hello again. Welcome to the Living Strong Television Network broadcast. Well, I'm your host, a Prophet Johnson. Call a friend, call a neighbor, let them know. Time to come on home. Back to Living Strong. We're in that fastest 30 minutes. Starts right now. The message is pray. That's it. Yeah, just pray. But Prophet Johnson, that's it. Pray. Here we go. Captain, 30 minutes, 30 minutes only. We got to get out of here, man. I don't even feel like bugging around. Uh, 2 Chronicles, chapter number 7. Oh, Lord, here we go. We pray that you don't go to that, Prophet Johnson. Verse number, what? That's right, y'all know about heart. 14, not COVID-19. If my people, oh boy, which are called by my name. Here we go. Jesus shall humble themselves. Older generation say humble. You got to humble yourself. They take out the H and put in the U-M. Humble. Eliminate it. Stop. In the service. Cut, clip, throw, th throw out the Bible, get rid of everything. That's it. That's it. Eliminations. Rather than kings, queens, no, sir, no, sir. No, sir, I'm not sorry for nothing. I don't apologize for nothing. I don't need to repent. No, I don't. I'm number one. I'm numero uno, not numero duno. I'm numero uno. I'm the best, best, best in the West. That's all there is to it. You know, I'm the biggest, I'm the baddest, the bravest. You know, that's all there is to it. Nobody bad like me. Humble. No, sir, it's not going to happen. Got too much money, man. Oh. I'm the queen of the fox. I control this box. Umbo! We can't get past that. We can't get past that one word. We can't get past that because that's not, we, we just can't get past it. Not going to happen. Not going to happen. Well, Prophet Johnson, move on. I can't. How can I? We got too much pride. If my people, which are called by my name, <clears throat> shall humble themselves and pray. See, this is one time that I don't even feel like criticizing nothing. Nothing at all. This is one time that I just basically want to be the nicest, kindest, most sweetest little sugared up, sugar weed, honeycomb, name something really sweet, uh, nectar, uh, I don't know what else. A real sweet, something real. A sugar cane preacher. You know. That's all there is to it. It's, it's called me the buttercup kid. We can't get past this. Couldn't even get past it on the radio. That's the radio broadcast message to pray. Couldn't get past it on that. There's no need in going nowhere. Because we got a problem. Well, Prophet Johnson, you're getting bored. Am I? I tell you what. Why don't we take about one minute to humble ourselves and pray? Let me show you how hard it is. I'm going to show you just how hard 
it is for people to do what I'm about to do. Father, forgive me for my arrogance. Forgive me for my selfishness. Forgive me for my ways and my thoughts that have not been pleasing to you. In my actions, in the sinfulness of my life, help me to walk upright before you and to proclaim the righteousness of the blood-stained banner of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Protect and shield and keep me as the apple of thine eye. I've failed you so many times and I need you all the time. Help me not to get upset and to remove pride and let me not be jealous of people around me and let me not be easily offended over what they do to hurt me. Rather, it's me or my children. Help me, even in my job, not to try to be more than what I am. You gave me what you gave me. I got what I got because of you. Take away all of this pride and selfishness, the things that I do my way and show me your way, Father. And I thank you in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. See, see that, that hurt, didn't it? That hurt. No, we're not going to do that. This is what we're going to do. Father, in the name of Jesus, uh, you said no weapon formed against me was going to prosper. And them devils over there next door, uh, that's all they do uh, is raise hell. Uh, and what I need for you to send me a miracle. And, and just kill them up, move them and get them out of here in the name. God going to move them. Thank you, Jesus. God going to move Watch God move them. Watch God move them. You better not mess with me. I'm on the Lord's side. You see? I never knew how powerful deception was until I realized that all my life I had been deceived. I didn't realize powerful the word of God was when he declared in his word of how wicked a woman could be how crafty she was and her ways was past finding out I didn't think in my mind of people being like this until being Prophet Johnson? No, not me. Not me, God. But see, the enemy knew what to do. To give you something that wasn't worth God's glory. In the end, I couldn't understand how I could love evil men. I'm talking about men of power with a heart of unconditional love, just like God, just like God. Until the Lord told me, he said, your heart is like mine when it comes to love, forgiveness, and humans. He said, even your enemy that desire to see you dead 
that would rejoice at the sign of the word that Prophet Johnson is digging his grave and he's going to die, the rejoicing would be so great until the family would get together and thank God. I didn't realize how powerful this love of God is until the Lord said to me, you would be such a fool until you will love your enemies to your own detrimentation and death. He said, you will love even the one that's got a knife to your throat like a lamb and preparing to kill you with full hatred. I said, well, I said, because I feel sorry for that person. He said, that's not happening to you. He said, you can see those people now, that person, and you can feel sorry for those leaders everywhere now he said, you do. You feel sorry for government agents. You feel sorry for presidents and queens. He said, you really do feel sorry, don't you? I said, yeah, I really do. You know, I can name them all. I felt sorry for 44 and his family. I feel sorry for 45 and his family. I feel great sorrow. It hurts. I feel sorry for the agents of this world. Even the policeman out there that was hunting the, the polar black people in the COVID-19 neighborhood. That was funny to watch the police <laughs> ride through the black people neighborhood <laughs> hunting them <laughs> during COVID-19. I said, police ain't got nothing else to do but hunt the black man. If that's true, y'all. I, I watched this stuff just yesterday out on the highways and stuff. I look at it all the time. It's, it's, it's funny to see how it works. It's really funny. White people don't see it in society. That's why I spoke to the policeman. And he, he let me know that this is who you are. He said, they took, they took, you think they'll take your kindness as a weakness. They'll say that you are a fool. And once a person find you as a fool, believe me, they're going to use you. They're going to use you. And God said, don't be no fool for God. Not like that, that they won't. Because then you're just a family fool. You are their fool. And they're going to use you as a fool. And then God spoke something to me. And he said, now with all of that love, the evil men or made, they are made, they are born as evil. This is who they are. I said, what? This is who they are. <coughs> so, when I see this, he have to show me that you don't understand, son. This is evil. This is death. This is a coral snake. This is a rattlesnake. This is a tapan. This thing will kill you. Get away from that evil. Lest Jesus must use his power through you to stop this. I'm sitting up there thinking to myself now, this is getting to be more real than I realize. Then the Lord said, now I'm going to reverse all of that. I'll show you how this worked now. Prophet Johnson, we still, because we can't get off of that word, we can't get past it. I'm trying to get Oh, God help me, Lord Jesus. Whew. I'm going to have to get checked out. My own self here. Feeling a little. 
I'm trying to see how many people did I hug, Captain. I, I shouldn't have touched none of them children. Right, the blood of Jesus crossing half omega. Here it is. Now, what are we talking about anyway? Oh, the reversal. Here's the reversal. The Lord spoke to me and said, now, they think you're weak, don't they? I said, yeah. They think you're like little old bitty Pee Wee Herman, don't they? I'm like, yeah. They think you graduated from the school of wimpology, don't they? I'm like, yeah, I did. I graduated and I flunked uh, with uh, three F's in loader bar. You know, they think you're just a worm, don't they? Said, yeah. He said, well, now, uh, let's reverse all of this. Let's take it from the lamb now. Remember the lamb, the lion, the cross? I never could finish. He said, let's go to that lamb, and my God is a consuming fire. He said, now, where's the fire of Prophet Johnson? I said, it's here. He said, you better believe it. He said, David carried a harp in one hand and a sword in the other. I'll carry a song in one hand and a sword in the other. Why? Because I know now. I know who I am. The little lady. Thank God for Mary. Oh, do I miss Mary. That's Mary's baby that told me the truth with tears in her eyes cutting up a salad. Looked at me and cried. Just preparing a simple salad something to eat and said prophet Johnson I'll never forget that day with the knife in her hand started crying said you don't know who you are do you? said you don't know who you are so embarrassed said but you're gonna find out and when you learn who you are it's going to change your life. And those people are going to wish that they'd have never messed with you. See, you don't mess with God's anointing. You're going to play them other preachers. You're going to play them other ladies. You're going to play, play them other folks. But don't touch God's anointing. Father, in the name of Jesus, I receive the full power of right now. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name. You're not going to get away. Period. Period. When you touch God's anointed. That's all there is to it. Now, this COVID-19 deal, this deaf angel, you want to try, folks, he really want to mess with people. And God showed me something. The father said, son, this is where faith and power has got to override fear and foolishness. And the foolishness is Thinking you can do anything. The fear is not having the faith. At the same time, when you're riding down the road, do y'all feel that thing when you're driving now? You can feel it. You can feel it outside the windows. You can feel something. It's, a, it's almost like it, a, a, an evil darkness moving through light that you can't see and you're wondering you know who may have this uh, and then you go and you see and you never thought about it 
that when you live your life, you never thought about the doorknobs that you're touching. When you go into the store, you just take for granted that you just open the freezer and pull out a soda. Now you can't do that. You, you, you wonder about touching the handle, even to go into the inconvenience store. Now you're glad to walk into the grocery store and the things slide open. You just walk in now. You don't want to touch nothing. But then when you walk into the grocery store, you look at the basket and you wonder who had this basket before I had it or I'm going to get it. All this stuff go through your mind. Precautionary measures. But the time that we're in, it is real. Let's see if we can read the scripture and we're going to try to get through this uh, we own one verse, remember? Just one verse of scripture. Let's try it one more time. Second Chronicles, where we are, chapter number seven. And in case you forgot, verse number 14. I'm watching, I'm watching this air up in here. And this and this little old, you know, I better watch this up here. I don't want to watch this here. I don't, I don't want no, <coughs> no, no coughs and sniffles coming on me. I know, my, I know my regular stuff now. My regular stuff, I can handle that. Sitting down here and stuffing by the air, you see. I'm looking at that air up there and the thing's spinning, getting me stuffed up here. And y'all know me. I'm going home and isolating anyway. Where, Prophet John? In the refrigerator. Here it is. Second Chronicle chapter number 7, verse number 14. If my people, <clears throat> that's you, if you're viewing this broadcast. Prophet Johnson, will you re please read that? No, ma'am. No, sir. Which are called by my name shall humble Captain, maybe I need to get the dictionary and see what the word humble means. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, P, H, U, M. Is H, U, M, how do you spell it? B, L, E. There it is. Um, humble. Uh, humble. Are we trying to get past one word? What's that? Humble side. Humble. Humble. Human rights. Um, humble be. Humble be. Oh, there it is. Humble. Here it is. Humble. <clears throat> Let's make sure I spell this right. H-U-M-B-L-E. That's it. Now, hold on. It's, um, it's, uh, it, it's this fan, Captain. <coughs> I fogged up my glasses. Hold on here. Humble. Uh, humilious. Mm -hmm. Humble. Hey, old folk do got it right. They, it does sound like humble in the original language, humble. And the adjective blur, okay, which is the me off of the humilious, low. It means low, small, slight, akin to humus. Of a, of a low, slight, or small form akin to humus or soil or earth. Is that the right word? Oh, there it is, yeah. In other words, you get down low to the earth. You don't mind getting back to the dirt where you come from. Humble, hold on, y'all. Uh, in case you can't see me, I got the dictionary up in front of me. See, it's called the Webster's. New World Edition College, uh, 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 fourth edition, here it is. Now, uh, Prophet John, no, sir, no, ma'am. We, we can't get past this. That's the problem with coronavirus. We can't get past it. Now, now let me read it. Boy, they running up my blood. Hold on. Humble. It means having or showing a consciousness of one's defects or shortcomings. Maybe I talk about myself too much. Maybe I'm a little too humble. 
Showing one's defect or shortcoming. Remember the prayer I pray? We don't, we're not going to do that. Not proud. Not proud. Not self-assertive. You hear that word, self-assertive? They, boy, they, they get me with that broadcast every, every Sunday. I'll be, I'll be honest with you. They get me with that broadcast every Sunday with what they play after I preach. I shouldn't have said that because I didn't want them to know that either. But they heard it. Oh, well, they heard, they heard it on this broadcast, not the radio. Not self-assertive. Modest. You hear that, Captain? Now, you don't want to listen to that either. You like the rest of them. Modest. Low in condition. I don't nobody want to be humble. Low in condition. Captain means low in rank. Low in position. Or lowly. I like this word right here. Unpretentious. Unpretentious. Yes, yes. In other words, they can't pretend. They ain't fake. Humble. Which means a humble home. To lower in condition, rank, or position. To abase. To lower in pride. To make modest or humble in mind. Which means humbleness. Ain't that some? Ain't that some? Mm, Jesus. See, some people are quiet and sneaky. There's a difference between quiet and sneaky and being humble. I know some old preachers and old bishop try to be humble. Oh, he's so humble. Quiet and sneaky. Give me a hug. Humble. Yeah, you humble, all right. I'm right on in that bed. Better believe it. Oh, quiet and sneak. Ain't no humble. Captain, I'm closing. Captain, if I, Captain, I'm read this verse and we're going to close out because I'm, I'm through suffering. If my people, which are called by my name, shall humble themselves and Pray and seek my face and turn from their wicked ways. You know what? COVID-19 is not going to stop the rent folks from coming to get their money from your house. COVID-19 is not going to stop no bill collector in the lying government. COVID-19, Lord, this, this spirit, is going to have folks in the streets. They getting ready to make so much money. The lying, the cheating, and the stealing. Captain, I just got fired up. We got to go. The lying, the cheating, and the stealing that they doing through the billions and the trillions of dollars. Stock market wiped out. Rich, rich man weeping how. They getting ready to steal from them poor folk. That, they, they, they're not going to pay y'all bills. Don't pay your rent. COVID-19 going to put you out in the street with his brother. You getting out of his house. They ain't going to give you nothing. Nothing. You're through. Your job ain't going to help you. The get, you're done for. This is what's going to get you saved. Captain, I'm closing my blood. And pray and seek my face and turn from their wicked ways. Then will I hear from heaven and forgive their sins and will heal their land. You want to heal? No. No, no. I'm going home. And, and now mine eyes and mine. Now mine eyes shall be opened in my. That's when I'm going to listen. Unto the prayer that is made in this place. Sitting up talking about lying. They, they ain't going to pay nothing. Them devils going to want their money even if they got COVID-19. They going to want their money. They can be sick, coughing, sniffling on their way to the grave, but they going to get their rent money. So y'all better get them folks their money. 
Repeat after me. Say, Father, I'm a sinner. Forgive me for my sins. And I receive Jesus Christ as my Lord and my Savior. And I thank you in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. That's my time. Thank you for yours. I'll see you next time. That's going to be tomorrow night. Y'all have a good night. Bye. I'm wise. I'm wise.